here. And I'm, you know, to, to be honest with you, I don't, I'm not big on like New Year's resolutions or anything like that. Um, you know, as if you've listened to my, if you've listened to the Monday Mindset, if you've listened to me before, I always say that life is a continuing education unit. You you never stop learning. And, you know, New Year's resolutions are, in, in my way, are kind of just, they don't really have any real merit. Um, to me, you need to be continuously being consistent. And that requires constantly improving yourself. And even if you have setbacks, you have to hold yourself accountable and continue to move forward with that consistency. And, you know, you hear with a lot of New Year's resolutions, I'm going to lose this weight. I'm not going to drink. I'm not going to eat sugar. I'm not going to do this for this year or for this month or something like that. And I'm like, eh. How about you make a New Year's resolution that you're going to be consistent regardless? And that is what's more important is the consistency. Even with the setbacks, it's the consistency that matters. And, you know, that's the problem. You know, people will then will have these New Year's resolutions and they, you know, they they have a, you know, they have a week where they don't do, they don't work out or whatever. And then, you know, they're like, oh, well, that's it. You know, it's, it's done. I, I guess I'm going to have to wait till next year or start over all of this. And I'm like, no, you keep going. You hold yourself accountable and you get back to it. Um, and, and that's something that I, I firmly believe that even, you know, because we're all human. And if you don't acknowledge the fact that you are human, if you don't acknowledge the fact that um you are someone that is going to make mistakes and the best thing you can do for yourself is to move forward is to acknowledge the mistakes hold yourself accountable and then be that much better 